Welcome back. This morning we are shining our sunrise spotlight on Ben and Jerry's ice cream shops around the country because they are serving up free scoops all day today. Oh, I love that. Drew Carney is out. We're all jealous. He's there. <laughs> He's at a live downtown Portland scoop shop just a half block away from Pioneer Courthouse Square. Again, we're just we're all jealous of you this morning. <laughs> Good morning, China and Christine, <laughs> says the waffle cone. Okay. And I say good morning to you as well. <laughs> Wouldn't a waffle cone sound like that? In my head, a I waffle guess. cone sounds like that with Sorta. a big booming voice. <laughs> good morning. Welcome to the scoop shop. Uh, big news today from the Spen and Jerry scoop shop in downtown Portland on Southwest Yamhill. Today is free cone day. But more importantly, as we bring you this information on your screen, we're going to throw it in your face. It's free cone day, but it's also a fundraiser today for this terrific organization known as New Avenues for Youth. They own and operate this particular scoop shop on Southwest Yamhill in downtown Portland. So when you come here today for your free scoop, and we encourage you to do so, you can also make a donation to New Avenues by simply dropping a little money in the pot. An easier way, a more 2024 way to donate would be to hop online. We had that uh, website up a moment ago, easy to remember, newavenues.org. You can literally make a donation anytime through that website to this organization. Let's talk more about it. We're going to bring in the Director of Social Enterprise for New Avenues for Youth. Her name is Jenny Vinson. Uh, so Jenny, for starters, what exactly does social enterprise mean and how does this scoop shop speak to your social enterprise activities? Yeah, that's a great question. So a social enterprise is a business that um, serves two missions. We have both a mission to make money, like regular businesses, but then we also have an equally important mission, which is our social mission, which at New Avenues for Youth, of course, is to help um, kids here in Portland who have, um, are experiencing homelessness or who are at risk of homelessness. Is there a way to basically put on paper and identify that this scoop shop and also your other social enterprise business, the printing shop that they have on the east side, that these two businesses are actually making a difference in the lives of young people here in the Portland area? Yeah, so we serve between 25 and 50 kids a year at each location. So that's close to 100 kids. And over the past you know, 20 years, we've served over 1,000. And what we know is that kids who come through our program the majority of them, over 70%, have jobs or in school um, a year after they have their internships with us. I'll tell you that uh, not all, I feel comfortable saying this, not all nonprofit organizations are created equal. I've been working with New Avenues now for more than 20 years. I can tell you this is one that actually works. It's an easy organization to get behind. You can support them today by getting free ice cream and making a donation when you step up to order that ice cream to New Avenues or hop online, like we mentioned earlier, newavenues.org. This is an ice cream kind of day, though, so let's not forget about that. Did you see earlier we, uh, we picked out those great flavors for Christine and China and Rod? You saw that segment? Yes, I did. Fantastic TV, was it not? It was amazing. Okay, let's do that again. Let's have some more amazing television because this guy behind the camera Eric Patterson has been standing here all morning waiting for ice cream. Eric, this cone is for you. It is the mint chocolate chunk for Eric Patterson. I want you to enjoy that, Eric, okay? Enjoy that cone. Eric, Mike, Eric, you're not supposed to eat ice cream. What the heck? You don't eat ice cream like that? You're going to get a brain freeze. Oh my gosh, China. Christine Rod, I think he is getting a brain freeze. I'm losing him. I'm losing Eric Patterson this morning. Stand by, guy. Stand by. I know what can help here. Stand by, guy. <laughs> You know, you know what? What will help this brain freeze? A little sprinkle. Sprinkling to get the brain freeze away. Eric, come back to me. We will thaw <laughs> out Eric's brain. We will rejoin you during the 6.30 half hour. That's it for now, gang. And it goes black My with goodness. the sprinkles. Okay, Drew, we'll check back in. Best of luck to Eric. Drew Carney left the Sunrise Studio this morning to tackle a tasty topic on this Tuesday. He is live at the Ben & Jerry's Scoop Shop in downtown Portland. And this morning, he's talking about all the ways we can get free ice cream today. Drew, it helps a local nonprofit too. Awesome stuff there. That's right. We are talking about free cone day. Free cone day, Christine and China, and we do so outside this Ben and Jerry scoop shop in downtown Portland, which happens to be owned and operated by a local nonprofit called New Avenues for Youth. And I happen to be standing next to the executive director of New Avenues for Youth, Sean Sueb. So, Sean, I'm curious how a day like today, when you're literally giving away ice cream at your 
Scoop Shop, yep. how does this actually act as a fundraiser? Well, Ben & Jerry's Corporate sponsors all the free ice cream across the country. And in, in this location, we have incredible corporate sponsors like Bank of America, who are, is our presenting sponsor, who helps donate to the organization. The public can actually donate to New Avenues and help us raise funds for our homeless intervention services. And it also raises the visibility of our shops and our enterprises where we employ youth so that lots of people know about it and lots of people continue to come all year round and support these shops. So Director Brian Matthews, if we haven't done so already, and if we have, we can throw it up again. Information is regarding free cone day, there you go, and also what they call the Scoopathon here at this particular scoop shop in downtown Portland, noon to eight. Those are the hours where you can come by to get your free scoop. We encourage you to also make a donation to New Avenues for Youth when you're getting your free ice cream. You can also hop online anytime. The website's right there on your screen, newavenues.org, to support this organization that for 27 years now has been helping out homeless youth in our area and kids who are at risk of being homeless. So we, we really encourage you to support this great group. And now we have a little fun. So Sean's got an ice cream cone. I've got some helpers here. Some Walk ice. this way. We've got somebody. Eric Patterson, follow us with the camera. Excuse me, sir. I know you're, you're, you seem to be ignoring me, sir. Not even turning around to greet us this morning. We call that here we go, in TV here we go. 0 for 1. Here we go, here we go. We're over here? Over here? You think so, huh? I think so. All right. Crossing the street, legally, of course. Hello there, sir. Can I interest you in free ice cream this morning? No? Okay. This is it. You're the winner. I am the winner? Y you are the winner. What have I won? Last person standing. <laughs> Eric, that's, that's as far as you're going? Can you come to this corner with me real quick? Okay, sir. Eric, why didn't you cross the street? Were you afraid? I looked both ways. There were no cars coming. All right. Here we stand on this corner of uh, Yam Hill and Southwest 6th in downtown. What is your name? Ann. Ann, have you ever heard of New Avenues for Youth? Um, no. Have you heard of ice cream? Yes. Okay, would you like a free ice cream cone for breakfast this morning? Oh, can I pick the one I want? Oh, geez. Absolutely. Okay, yes, you can. Which one do you like? Uh, Strawberry. Vanilla. You got vanilla, milk strawberry, milk and, cookies. milk and cookies. And that's vanilla? That's vanilla. vanilla. Chocolate therapy. This is Cherry Garcia. This is my kid's favorite flavor. Oh, darn. My kids are never wrong when it comes to ice cream. Okay, there we go. So while you eat your ice cream, how much time do we have left, Producer Alex? How much time? Your train comes in a couple minutes? I only have 30 seconds. So here's the scoop. New Avenues for Youth. They've been around for 27 years. Okay. They own that Ben & Jerry Scoop Shop just a half block away from where we stand. Okay. They help homeless youth in our area. They help them through job training, educational opportunities. That's they wonderful. also, yeah, it is wonderful. They also help kids who are at risk of being homeless. You want to support that organization? Sure. Hop online when you get to where you're going, newavenues.org, make a donation, and enjoy that cone. Okay. Sound like a plan? Sound like a plan. You're thank on live you. TV this morning. Oh, thank you. Good morning, <laughs> Portland. You want to say hello to anyone in particular? No, not really. How about Rod Hill? He's a fine-looking fellow. He okay. does our weather forecast. Hi, Rod. Good Hi. morning, Good Portland. Morning. What's up, Portland? <laughs> What's up, Rod Hill? <laughs> High five with whatever hands left. Thank you very much. I appreciate it very much. <laughs> that was awesome. Rod, you got, you got an intro right there from her.